Hey guys, I am so excited to show you the new Stella Dot Tops. Um, I hope everyone had a great weekend. I know that you all prayed for me to receive my items in time to take them with me over the weekend. So thank you for your prayers because they worked. I was able to grab the box as I was heading out of town so I could wear this cute outfit to the vineyards on Saturday and I absolutely love it. And I was able to like rip everything open really quick and look at it all, um, knowing that I'd come back to you this week and show you everything. I can see somebody's hopping on. Hey, Rachel, um, say hi when you guys hop on. I would love to know who's out there and watching. Um, I ordered all the new tops because I wanted to be able to try them all on. Um, I am typically in between a size extra small and small in our tops. It just kind of depends on the style of the top and all of that. Um, I know some people think that we have some sizing inconsistency. I think it's pretty consistent. I think it's just me, like I'm in between sizes. So I actually have a variety of extra smalls and smalls and I think I did a really, somehow I did a really good job guessing which sizes to pick per each style. I think it's just kind of, I know my body type and kind of looking at it was able to guess what would work. I'm not keeping everything and I'll tell you what and why and show you and hopefully it will give you some insight into the tops, um, whether you're a stylist and you're looking at for what to either sample or to suggest for your customers or if you are one of my clients and you're looking online on the website and trying to decide what you love to update your wardrobe for the season. So starting off with what I'm wearing and what I absolutely love, this is the Lido tank and the vacay cardigan and I was actually kind of on the fence about this duo at first and quickly changed my mind I absolutely love it the cardigans already a one of the like top 10 pieces in the line I think like number two so with you guys know how popular things have been in our collection and how much is on back order at the moment. So if you love it, make sure that you grab it now. It's What's really cool is it has this subtle pattern in it. It's just like a big cocoon shape. It's nice like open knit um, and super soft, a uh, nice cream color and it's just a really good transitional weight for spring. If you live like in the Northeast, I think it'll be great for like those chilly nights on the beach um, and for us down here in the humid, hot south, grab it now. Otherwise, you won't have time to wear it before fall, <laughs> right? So I love it. And then I'm wearing this, the Lido Tank. This is um, in blush. It's kind of like a slub, it's what's called a slub fabric, which is what that, what that means is it's when it's like, I don't know if you can tell, it almost looks kind of heathered. Like you can see how it has parts that are almost a little bit more sheer. That's called a slub knit. Um, and it's just a little like lighter weight and soft. It almost has like a linen-y cotton feel. And you, you can wear it tied or untied. Um, I personally will never wear it untied. I just personally think that it looks like an untied top that's supposed to be tied. Um, but some people are saying they really like it that way. You do you and wear whatever feels good. Um, I like it tied. It's really similar to the tank that we had last summer that was um, uh, like a jade green kind of a color. This is a blush. It's a little, like I'm a little pale for this right now. I feel like I need the sweater to like break up the fact that it practically matches with my skin. But if I get a little bit of sun, um, I think it'll be great once it's actually really hot and I want to wear this with shorts and stuff. Love the necklace. This is the Abriana. I'm obsessed. This video is not about jewelry, but I can't not mention it. It's so cute. Um, and I am wearing a tank top underneath it. Uh, I like to wear a cami under things just in general. I think it makes your clothing look smoother. When it's really hot in the summer, I definitely won't wear it, but I also am wearing the cami so that I can try on all the tops and not you know get flagged for nudity on Facebook since I've already gotten flagged for um, copyright infringement on doing lip sync videos therefore that's why I'm no longer doing those so um, let me know as I'm going through this tell me what you really like I want to hear your feedback um, and I am gonna upload this live video to YouTube later so 
YouTube people, thank you for watching and would love to hear in the comments what you love also. And I will link everything also. Okay, so again, Lido. Oh, and sizing. This is the extra small slash small. Definitely true to size. And then this tank, I think it is, it is the extra small. And that's definitely the right size for me. For me, like I'm really small through my like rib cage area. So a lot of times with tank tops, I know I'll need to go down a size so that the straps and the like gapping underneath the arms is not um, too much. Okay, so next up I will show you the vacay tank. This is one of two white tank tops in the new arrivals, um, which is great to just have some basics for the summer. And this I ordered, I think this is a small, shoot. Let's see, can we see? Can we see it in the screen? Yeah, it's a small. Um, and I'm, I'm on the fence about this one. I don't think it fits me right because look how low cut this is. I mean, without the tank top, it's like halfway down my chest. It's way too low, um, but I don't know. If I swapped it out for an extra small, I don't know if it would be too small. It, I like how it goes a little bit longer in the back. And it has this little twist detail, which I honestly think is like a little bit pointless. I'm not really sure why that needs to be there. Um, but it is just a really nice lightweight tank for summer. Um, I, I honestly wish I had an extra small to compare it to, but this one I'm not keeping. It just definitely does not fit me right. Um, again, maybe it's again, like a, what I just said about tank tops. Maybe I just need an extra small, um, but it has a good length to it. And I like the idea of it. I might order the extra small to get to compare. That is the vacay tank. And I was trying on a small. All right, next I will try on this top, which I really like. I don't know what it's called. I'll have to look it up. I don't know what this one is, but it has, if, or if somebody's watching and they know, if you could comment what this is. I can't see any comments. I don't know if you guys are saying anything. Um, this one is, I like I almost didn't order it because it's very similar to the Bianca tee that we had last year, which I still wear all the time. And I was like, do I really need another white top with fluttery sleeves? But this one's totally different. So I was like, yes, of course I do. And it's ivory rather than a bright white. I love the detail on the sleeve with this eyelet. And I love the scoop neck where the Bianca is totally, like definitely a crew neck. And then the most surprising thing to me with this top is the fabric. It is super soft. It's like a stretchy knit. I don't even know how to describe it. It is, it's not cotton. It's, it's, um, I don't know. I mean, I can look at what the actual blend is. It is, Viscose, 94% viscose, 6% elastane in the, on the body. And it's super, super like silky soft, feels really comfortable. I really like it. I'm planning to wear it actually with, hang tight, hang tight. With this, this wrap skirt that I got from the loft, which is really cute. I'm not sure if it's still in stock. Um, but I'm excited to wear that together as an outfit. Um, I'll, I can look that up and see if it's still available. So this one I really like, again, this is an extra small. So I would definitely go with, if you're in between sizes, go with the smaller size. I think if I, if I went up, it would be like too baggy. And next up is the ribbed tank. This is a piece that I was really excited about just because it's a really, really good basic. And you could definitely get something like this just from like Old Navy for 10 bucks or something. But this is, you can tell from the feel of it that it's really just a great quality. It has nice stretch to it. So it really is gonna hold its shape. And um, it's a really soft fabric. So I went up to the, the larger size for me on this. So this is the small, um, and I think that was right. I think an extra small would just be really tight, 
and I don't know, you would feel like you had to like suck your stomach in all day long. Mainly the reason why I'm really excited about this is because it's gonna be a great base layer underneath like the Carly and the Addy poncho. I wear the Always Tank under mine a lot, which is black and has the little lace detail, so it looks really cute. But the black does not go with this navy one. And so this will be perfect to wear as the under layer for this, the Carly, which also comes in rose. Um, and then you can wear it also as a poncho. Which then has a little cutout. But I love this, like, great under the poncho or the cardigan version like this but especially when you are wearing it as a poncho I don't like when my bra strap is showing so rather than wearing just a, a thin cami like this underneath it where you just see these two skinny little straps I like to have this thicker strap to cover it and look like pulled together um, so that is the essential ribbed tank which I would highly recommend um, I think it's just gonna be, it's just one of those like essential pieces that you need in your wardrobe. Um, and two more left. There is the twist tee. I don't know if that's actually what it's called. This black t-shirt, which has a V-neck and like a cap sleeve. It's that same slub material in black and I got I think I got a small I'll check in a second I'm pretty sure this is a small this one is definitely going back it is just not working for me um, I'm not sure who it works for to be honest with you um, it's very short in the torso which I don't think that that's I think that's actually coming in to be more of a trend as high-waisted pants and shorts and skirts just high-waisted is the trend for bottoms so I think hemlines on shirts are starting to shorten up a little bit um, so I don't think that this is like an error but just for so you are aware it is short in the front and when with where the twist is it kind of shows your stomach so um, that actually doesn't drive me totally crazy what drives me crazy is one the V is way too low for me and then also, I'm not sure if you can see this in the video, but the way that the twist is right in front, it is not flattering. It just like pokes out. And um, like I want, I want this t-shirt to work because I feel like it would just be a great basic tee, but I'm not gonna keep it. Um, so that's my thoughts on that one. And then last but not least, one of my favorite styles and I actually would love your feedback on this because I got a small oh let me tell you what size the black one was the black one's a small as well and again that one's tough like if I with how low the V hits if I got an extra small it's definitely gonna be like a belly shirt um, so unfortunately that one is just not my favorite and then this top I don't know what it's called either but it is so cute, I love it. It also is kind of a different material than I expected. I was thinking it was gonna just be a woven cotton, which it is, but it also is textured. So the, you, I don't think you're gonna really be able to tell from the video, but the white stripes are, are a little bit raised. So it's, it seems like it's, you know, that adds some extra detail to it. Um, the Detailing with the embroidery on the sleeve is gorgeous. It has the little like cut out eyelet right there. And then behind your neck, it has a little button closure. This is the small, and I'm not sure if it's the right size for me. Would love your feedback. I feel like since I could tell it was like a boxier style when I was ordering it, and so I wasn't sure if with an extra small, if it would start to get too tight around my hips right here. But I feel like with the small, it looks really big through the shoulders. So I would love your feedback. Or do you think it just looks good to have it be kind of like loose and fitted, unfitted? Um, let me know what you think. But that is all the tops. Um, 
My favorites are definitely this one, if I can get the sizing figured out. The rib tank, go up one size if you're in between. Um, I love the Carly, which isn't new from April, but it just came out in March um, and is just perfect. And I also love the Lido tank, um, this flutter sleeve one, and the um, Vacay cardigan. So I will post links to those below. I would love to hear which ones that you liked, and I hope that you found this video helpful. All right, you guys, have a great rest of your evening, and um, let me know if I can help you with anything.